Okay, so it looks like we're back to our flooring 19 um, problem. So let's go, let's just write flooring 19. Remember, mass number of flooring is 19. Um, it asks, well, what's the, well, what's the mass in AMU of this? Well, 19. So mass AMU of this flooring atom is 19. Um, well, we'll do it to four decimal places. Uh, and, I mean, four sig figs. And, you know, because it asks you to do that. Um, and then it asks, well, what's the mass in Dalton's? Well, remember, one Dalton equals one AMU. So if you want to do the conversion factor, so the mass in Dalton's is going to be 19.00 AMU times one AMU, one Dalton. Cancel, cancel. 19.00 Dalton's. Okay, and then it asks you, well, um, how, well, what's the mass of one of these fluorine 19 atoms in grams? Well, remember that um, conversion factor that I gave you. One Dalton equals 1.661 times 10 to the negative 24th grams. So when you got that, just say the mass in grams equals 19.00 Daltons. Multiply that by 1 Dalton, 1.661 times 10 to the negative 24th grams. 1.661. Cancel, cancel. Get our calculator out. So 19 times 1.661 e negative 24. And I get so the four sig figs three point. This one we've got around so one five six times ten to the negative twenty third. So that's how many grams one fluorine 19 atom weighs. In fact, if you wanted to, um, you could do get an, you, then you got another conversion factor, right? So one fluorine 19 equals 3.156 times 10 to the negative 23rd grams. So I know. Well, we'll put this part in the problem. Um, how many uh, grams does four of these things weigh? Well, so, so four, four, or we'll say, not four, we'll say ten. Okay. How many grams does ten uh, of these fluorine atoms weigh? Well, just move your decimal place, right? So. 